The mystery of revelation, is it solved? Professor claims that he knows the identity of the evil one, the Antichrist, that is. According to the Christian Catechism, the Antichrist or the devil, mentioned in the Bible and with the number 666 in the book of Revelation of St. John, the beloved disciple of Christ, is described as one who will fulfill biblical prophecy, opposing the Lord on the day of Revelation. However, now according to the theory of an academic, the evil one requires face and identity. Cornell University professor of ancient Mediterranean religions, Kim Haynes Elson, who specializes in early Christianity and early Judaism, argues that the number of the beast, the infamous 666, which names, uh, which uh, the professor names as the Roman Emperor Nero, in fact, sharing the theory of the Netflix series History of God, presented by Nor Morgan Freeman. And according to the academic, Although the last part of the New Testament, the book of Revelation, which describes in detail the last days of the world, is considered a religious reading with a multitude of symbolism, it's also a political text, the professor says. We know that the book of Revelation is not at all mentioned in any Christian church because it's so uh, difficult to interpret. The professor says makes a political report on the cause of evil or who is responsible for the evil, there is a strong argument that 666 refers to Nero, the Roman Empire emperor who remained on the throne from 54 to 67 AD. Professor noting, explaining that if one applies numeric values to Kaiser Neron name and adds them up, it ends up to the number 666. And the professor, in fact, points out that other versions of the book of Revelation attribute the number of the beast to be 616, something that ultimately serves as another confirmation of the story, the theory. And the professor says one might think that this number eliminates the possibility that it's Nero. What is impressive with this, however, is that it helps to confirm the identity of Nero, as this is the number that appears when you write the name Nero in Latin, typically stating uh, the documentary series. Now, this is uh, translated for you from a Greek article. Please leave your comments and thank you for your support. Please support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.